Hello, and welcome to my Let's Play of Legend of the Void Chapter 2. I just finished Legend of the Void Chapter 1, and now we're going to continue in Chapter 2. Okay, so I did try reloading Necromancer to Necromancer, but sadly, he cannot import into this game. Because if you try importing, you have to... There's too many changes, and you can't import from the first game, so that is too bad. You will have to start new with a new. Okay, you will start with a new necromancer. Necromancer. All right, let's see. Just a generic here. I don't think he needs a beard. That's not gonna help you summon spirits from the deep. Some creepy eyes. Let's just go with that one. It's pretty generic. Nose. Let's stick with that one. Mouse. Nah, uh, let's just have a... Yeah, just call them extras. Nope, don't need anything. Skin. Hair color. I don't know, I haven't really thought. Probably it's just necromancer, necromancer. Let me get some black hair. Hair saturation. Hair tint. Uh, what color hair would a necromancer have? Hair tint. All right, that works. I think. I don't like that red hair. Let's just change this. Green? Okay, that green hair. No, not lime green hair. That looks terrible. Mossy green. Okay. Yeah, that kind of works. I guess. It'll work. Good quality graphics. Allow. The land of Caldaria is on the brink of chaos. The void ritual. Cast by the evil arts mage Chasm only a few moons ago, commanded hordes of undead to rise and lay waste to humanity. A hero arose to challenge the arts mage, destroying him while in the midst of summoning the powerful void lord to the mortal realm. It was as the ancient tomes had predicted. Only the beginning of what was set forth in the prophecy of the end times. Now, after spending what feels like an eternity imprisoned in the void, battling for control of your mind, you reach the final demon standing between you and your escape to consciousness. Okay, I hope you can hear that well. This video recorder does not record the audio, in-game audio. Okay, just that guy. Call of the Void. It's not gonna save you. Maybe it will. It felt like I was trapped in the void for a lifetime. How long have I been down here? And where's my friend Rogan? Rogan, where are you? I need you, Rogan. 
should put out some shoes. I bet we. Oh, we do have shoes now. They're not good shoes. But at least we start the game with shoes. Not like last time. Alright, we got some skeletons. Oh gosh, and I'm by myself. Oh, I need my spirit. Summon my spirit to help me fight. Level up, you level up, you get sweet attribute points. Yes. Enemy types, enemies with heavy armor, do less damage, may just have less health, do a lot of damage. Rogues are nice balance. I think rogues just have good scatter damage. And warriors have good single target damage. And mages can just do all kinds of things. Junk items, equip items. Okay, strengths is physical power, agility is non-magical attacks, daggers and bows. Okay, yeah. And will power up magic and constitution as your health. Same as last time, just a bunch of will power and constitution and magic for me. Ooh, new skills. Now this is what's great about this the second game. You got an excellent skill tree. When you level up, you will also receive one skill point to learn a new skill list. More advanced skills require you to be at a certain level to learn them. Some require knowledge of the skill below as well. It's easy to understand. So I love about the second one. It's got so much good stuff. Here's all the arcane stuff. Here is, um... Well, that's elemental. These are the arcane things. Systems. Here's my skeleton, spirit, and a demon. Oh yes, and they have all of these um maggoty attacks. The maggot ball, maggot rain, swarm blast, swarm lord. Leech life. Leech life was actually pretty good last time. The master necromancer. Yes. Let's begin our journey to becoming a great summoner of the evil seas. Um, is, is the necromancy even evil? What is this? What is this? I can feel the power of this book running through my veins. Ancient tomes. Has ancient tomes provide you special abilities. Oh yeah. That's like a magic power. A big instant use magic power. I know that. Okay. But yeah, I mean, you can just be summoning good people to help fight you. Like these beetles. Oh, these things are gross. From it. Oh yeah, there it is. That's the tone right there. Okay, I think this is just a heal one. Yes. I can only summon one at a time. I am not a master necromancer yet. A master necromancer can summon two at a time. Alice. Is that really necromancer? The Void Slayer. Everyone said you died at the Black Gate, but here you are. My name is Alice. I'm a scout for the expedition. The Empire sent to find you and Rogan. I haven't seen trace of Rogan since I woke up, but I remember the battle with Garzan clearly, and I know he was hurt, or worse. But wait a minute, you said the Empire sent you? How long have I been down here? It's been many days since the Black Gate erupted. You must have been out for a long time. It's incredible that you've survived. Let's get you back to camp. My captain will want to speak with you immediately. There are some necromancers on the pass back that I was able to sneak by alone. But since there's two of us now, we're going to have to fight our way out. I'll follow your need, ne Necromancer. Why don't we just get them to join my team? If we all work together, we can summon an army of the dead. Save it. 
Legend of Sacred Thunder. I like this. Battle these guys. Deep Necromancer. Here is Alice's skill. Alice, the list. Regular bow attack, power shot, and concentration. Okay, it's extra damage. You do that, and I'll summon. Skeleton's not as strong as his skeleton. Okay, did you just have that? Did you have to like summon him in battle? On a blue orb, a character's health bar that uses detailed information. Okay. Right there. Okay. He doesn't show in the bottom corner like last time. And you just summon a skeleton. I'll do that too. Level up. Okay. Um, let's just boost my constitution a lot because that is low. I need to be a bulky. Um, uh, let me just take this first. I need to boost my skeleton. It's the Void Slayer! Alice found him? Yes. Yes. Alright. Captain. Alice, you're back. And is this who I think it is? Necromancer? The Void Slayer? Excuse me, it's Necromancer of Necromancer. Amazing. Let me ask you, one soldier to another, what was it like fighting a Void Lord? Captain Taylor, there are more pressing issues at hand, Necromancer. All we on the outside saw was the Black Gate erupt after you and Rogan entered. What was the true result of your battle? Is Archmage Gazin really dead? Yes, I killed Gazin myself in battle. The Void Lord, Blake, is either dead or back in the Void as well. I don't know where Rogan is, but I did find this book on the way out of the inner chamber. Is that an ancient tome? One has not been seen for centuries. Perhaps Gazin was used to communicate with the Void. You must get to the Seer Council in the capital at once. The Seer Council are the leaders of all Magi. Their council is located west of Calderia City Square. Once you're in Calderia City, I gotta go. I'm almost out of recording time. Alice, accompany the Void Slayer to Calderia City. I'm sure you're not up to strength after being trapped in here so long. Maybe you can load a thing or two. Here's some gold for supplies. Thank you. Get going. Okay, thank you for watching. I will see you in part two of, 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 of Legend of the Void. Goodbye.